Hey guys, welcome to Miss School 33. My name is Ray. In this one here, we're going to look into Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber, the current energy that's between the both of them. Um, if you find yourself enjoying, please do me a favor, hit that like button, share, comment, subscribe. What is the current energy between Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber? Current energy between Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber, please. Okay. Two of Wands with the King of Cups at the bottom here. Got the information. So there, it looks like there's debate of taking a different route. It's easy they're getting family, like information from family or some type of happy information here. The homestead. We do have the Queen of Swords here as well. I don't know who the Queen of Swords is. Whoever this Queen of Swords is, though, they're both bound to. Being held on tight to on Haley's side for sure. The current energy between Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber, please. Going towards a blockage, a wall. Receiving something valuable with this Queen of Pentacles here and being able to move forward. What is the current energy? Balancing out a plan from learning out of apathy. There's some sort of hidden message here. Something that's mysterious. It's hidden from the world. Something's going on from the that's not in the public eye. With this Queen of Pentacles. The current energy between Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber, please. The Six of Pentacles. This is something that is thought of, when it's thought of in solitude, it quickly manifests. Like, it's like, it's either this Queen of Pentacles or it's me. That's the decision for you to make. That's what it looks like is going on here. Trying to balance a plan out of moving past this wall, but unable to because there's too much apathy that's been handed out. It's, it's something that's, it's like, enough is enough. Are you done with this Queen of Pentacles, or are you moving on with me? What is the current energy between Justin Bieber and Haley? High Priestess, there's secret Secret seeds that are being placed. 
hidden messages about this. She is also trying to use her intuition through this because she is feeling a lot of pain, disappointment about this. We're going to look into their 2024 then, their overall. So it looks like whatever, well, I'm sensing there was some sort of argument and fight involved. Because somebody would want to try to get their point across about the situation, if not both parties. Let's use another deck and take a look further into it. Could you give us more insight on what's going on here? Could you give us more insight on what's going on here? The energy between Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber. There's a new chapter. And it's starting with apathy here. Manifesting, discussing, placing their energy, placing seeds into giving the cold shoulder, providing a cold shoulder. It's coming in quick. A big transformation here, especially for Justin and his path. It might be because of Justin Bieber. With what we have with the first deck, it looks like the path that he decided to take. Putting a, a wall to Haley. Like, trying to cut off communication. It's also seeing something through a different lens, trying to have, it looks like she's going to ha try to have him see their relationship differently. The Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, with the Five of Swords. There's secret stress and conflicting energies and thoughts. A lot of tricky, maybe sneaky, sudden actions that have happened. Somebody is happy here and somebody is stressed. So, therefore, that tells me that somebody's causing the stress. Well, this person that's causing the stress is the one that's being happy or feeling the happiness, receiving happiness. While the other one that has the conflicting feelings. It's all the negative energy. Hey, priestess. Secret actions. She's fantasizing about him being happy with his Queen of Pentacles, trying to get him to see things differently. It's like manipulating him to stay. There's like this reviving helping hand at home that's a masculine energy fire sign. 
This could be her stepping in the masculine energy. She's being sneaky out of out of spite because she wants to keep a hold of this relationship, but he wants to move forward. And it's almost like he's trying to make it clear here. But that's what he feels as though he's being drawn to is closer to this Queen of Pentacles because it brings so much happiness. But she's not liking that, which I get. Um, I'm just being the messenger here. So she's feeling all of this pain. Because of this, she's reaching out for a helping hand, which seems as though it's that Queen of Swords. And some King of Wands involved to help her create some sort of manipulation line to keep him comfortable for a little while. It's almost like creating a little bit more fog, making things a little cloudy so it's hard for him to see clear. I hope that makes sense. So now we're going to move on to looking into their 2024. Two thousand twenty-four for Justin and Haley Bieber. What could you tell us about two thousand twenty-four overall? Two thousand twenty-four for Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber. What does 2024 look like for Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber, their relationship? Receiving a helping hand in some sort of plan. Trying to heal the marriage for this King of Pentacles. I personally assume that this King of Pentacles is Haley's dad. Planning a new chapter and taking a new route at the same time. What does 2024 look like for Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber, please? Feeling bound to the partnership of this King of Pentacles. <laughs> it's like eating off of what comes into the home. Some shape or form. This King of Pentacles keeps showing up. 2024 for Justin and Haley Bieber. It's almost like learning about family or learning about how to be happy here. Moving very quickly on this, taking a new route. And it's basically a whole new chapter here. But it's, it's to move towards a better land.
It's to try and turn this around. But <laughs> doesn't look like it's going to turn around. 2024 for Justin and Haley Bieber, please. Looks like the year is going to try to be optimistic and trying to bring happiness, but it looks like it's going to be inevitable to be a challenge. Because this Queen of Pentacles is a new opportunity to the lover. So I can see the Tower card with the Sun card going two ways. A burst of happiness for this lover with the Queen of Pentacles. <clears throat> and destruction upon happiness for the Haley, the other party. The one who's not in love with the Queen of Pentacles. 2024. For Justin and Haley Bieber, please. But it becomes a problem for the King of Pentacles. Yeah. So then in comes this, this King of Swords. Oh, I wanted to also mention. I thought it was kind of funny. Is, uh, somebody out there could probably answer this. I heard on the radio that Haley Bieber is supposed to be at the iHeart Radio. I don't know if it was awards or New Year's stuff. I don't remember exactly. I remember I heard that and then I'm like, hold up. And my baby was cooing because we have a radio playing for him so he sleeps better. And uh, they repeated it and I was like, shut up. So that. I wondered right there and then when I it, they said it again and I heard it right, I thought, now, question. Sorry, I'm going to pause the reading here. Question. Like, one, why didn't they mention Justin Bieber being there? They mentioned Haley. Okay, that, that's... That's kind of weird to me. Um, that kind of tells me or clarifies that I don't know if these people are invited. I assume they are actually if they are. There's an itinerary. Um, then did he not get invited? But if you do get invited, then aren't you able to bring a plus one? So then therefore, is this in like a route quite possibly to a wand situation here where she can take that step out of the box for a moment and see things from this hangman situation that was coming up now i wonder if that's when the queen of swords is going to come in interesting Because this the Queen of Swords always comes up. And me personally, I always think that's whichever it is, Kylie or Kendall, if it's one or both, that she hangs out with. I don't know if one of them is an air sign or not. But either way, when we ever get this King of Pentacles, we always get the King of Swords recently since Scooter Braun has left the building. And it's like either... They go to Scooter Braun for advice on financial matters when it comes to her dad, this King of Pentacles. Because this whole marriage was a whole new opportunity for him because Justin Bieber did help them financially. Like there was a web that there was an article I read that even the last line it said that Justin Bieber had helped him financially and it even had like the dollar amount there. I don't remember what the dollar amount was. It was like a couple of thousand or a couple hundred thousand. I don't remember a hundred percent, but it was in the thousand range for sure. So that's why I think they rely on Scooter Braun and at least his advice on how to handle things with 
Justin Bieber and his career and try to maintain control of him and handle situations the way they would prefer to for an easier, better outcome for them. It's a very selfish situation, especially the most selfish with this King of Pentacles than Haley Bieber. But, you know, we don't really know how things really are behind the scenes, you know. Somebody can say that they're a saint and try to paint themselves as a saint and really deep down inside they are not. So, and that's what it looks like is happening here because his king of pentacles wants healing in this situation. He wants his ten of pentacles in this new creation that's being created in this tower moment. So it looks like he's relying on this king of swords here to help him create a some sort of balance with a good finance. Whether it's him making money off of his daughter or it's his daughter, him making money off of his daughter being married to Justin Bieber. And this King of Swords is showing up now as a chain connection. So it's like her dad is trying to resolve. It's really like he's the one that's trying to make this plan. That deals with their marriage. So it's learning about how to move forward on this new chapter, this new path. It's a new chapter and a new path, a new journey. It's like a double whammy in one. Extreme burst of energy. Fool card, two of, of wands, the tower card, ten of pentacles, ace of wands. That's a lot. Of oh, boom, 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 boom. And it's planned. Might even be like work wise to them because there is a finance, something being handed out here, something worth of value. So this is where I'm going to leave the reading off at. Um, if you found yourself enjoying, please do me a favor. Hit that like button, share, comment, subscribe. Until next time, you guys, off you to Zane.